Hey you guys, welcome to your um, weekend edition Love in General reading. This is for the element of air. Um, so if you're a Libra, Gemini, or an Aquarius, Sun, Moon, or Rising, these messages are for you for the weekend of January 22nd through the 24th, 2021. So I want to thank all of you for all your love and support. Please keep in mind these are general, so they may or may not resonate, uh, but hopefully you get some clarity. Um, also, if you're wanting to book a personal or private reading, be sure to uh, check the description box below for ways to reach me. Um, if you are wanting to t reach me by phone, uh, it's a separate process. So make sure that you are subscribed at Bill Per Call, or I'm sorry, registered, and uh, request call back from me. If I do not return your call that day, I will get back to you within a seven day time frame. Um, so yeah, and also don't forget to check out Patreon. The Venus sign readings are there now, as well as bonus and additional content you might enjoy. Okay, so we have the central issue, Heart of the Matter, is the Seven of Swords. Uh, we have Justice. We have the King of Swords. We have the Queen of Pentacles. Strength. Judgment. Ace of Wands. And the Will of Fortune. Okay, so overall energy has something to do with um, maybe someone withholding information or being deceptive about a potential contract or an agreement. So let's say, for instance, you're getting ready to start a job um, or any type of paperwork that you're filling out. I feel like information is being left out. Um, maybe you're filling out paperwork and you're like, I'm just going to leave that part out where I got arrested or I'm not going to put in that part. I'm not going to tell my true credit score. I'll put this, um, you know, just to at least get the application through. Like something's going on where I feel like you're dealing with deception and contracts. Um, Maybe something is not written into the job description that you originally originally agreed to. Um, hmm. I'm also getting that you might be trying to avoid a situation. You might be trying to avoid a soul contract or you're trying to avoid your destiny, something that is written in a star's something that's in your birth chart, something that you agreed to before incarnating here in this physical universe. Um, and I don't know, I kind of feel like you want to back out of it or you want to avoid it. Um, it also looks like spiritually that there are some sort of what do you call it? Um, mischievous spirits around you. I feel like there are some sort of spirits that may be trying to get your attention in mischievous ways. There also could be some sort of lurking going on. Someone might be checking out your social media. Um, maybe someone also has been running has a uh, run a background check on you without your permission um if there is anything in your background for a job situation i feel like a course is going to show but you know it still depends it doesn't mean that you're not going to get hired they may give you an opportunity to explain what happened I also feel like maybe someone is trying to offer, trying to pay for, uh, there may be some sort of money proposition that is deceptive in some way. And it looks like you are refusing or resistant towards whatever this offer is. Like somebody's like, I can make you some quick money or, you know, you should invest in this and then your money's going to be turned over. Like something's going on where maybe you are resisting some sort of financial opportunity, or maybe you don't trust it. Mm. 
but relationship wise I feel like maybe you are trying to avoid an earth sign I almost feel like you are trying to pretend like someone doesn't exist even if they're like standing right by you it looks like you're just like holding your head up and walking right by somebody or maybe they're doing this to you You might be ignoring someone's phone calls or rejecting them, especially if they're calling from a fake number or an anonymous number. You're like, I'm not answering that call. Or I know it's so-and-so, they just want me to pick up the phone. I'm not answering that call. So someone may be trying to get your attention in a way that is deceptive. Um, I feel too like there's some unfinished business that needs to be handled but you've been procrastinating um, also someone may want to speak to you or or say something directly to you but they may may not have the courage to do so that also might be a reason why they're trying to be deceptive in trying to reach you Whoever is guarded, I feel like they're not really ready to talk. You might be avoiding someone's uh, calls because you're just not ready or they aren't ready. But it does look like someone is like, okay, I'm ready to talk. Now you have my attention. What is it? Um, I don't know what changes, but something does change in your situation where maybe you are willing to listen or um, someone that you were ignoring you are now attracted to or they do something that just gets your attention. Mm. I feel like there's a new opportunity opening up for you. Something might be is coming off as once in a lifetime or rare. So I feel like if you want it, then grab it or take advantage of it. Something in regards to a Leo might be significant too. Um, they might be a Leo rising or they might have Leo in their chart. Mm. Something could change your life or change the path that you're on. It's possible that a romantic relationship could take a turn. Um, it, depending on the path that it was already on, something could take a turn for better or worse. I also feel like you are going to feel motivated, motivated or you hear something that motivates you to make a change in your life especially if you've been feeling stuck now you might not get some sort of response for the next 30 days If someone did not want to talk to you or you didn't want to talk to someone, like I said, I feel like someone is changing and they're willing to listen or let their guards down. I just feel like your situation is changing. If you were single, you might not be single or you might start a new relationship. Um, if you were in a secure relationship, you might end up single for whatever reason. Or maybe they have to, your partner has to go on an unexpected trip or flight so you'll be home alone. Like something's changing um, over the weekend. 
you either could suddenly come into a lot of money or suddenly lose a lot of money. I feel like something is also just up in the air. Something depends. Um, the answer or response depends on something. If you're wanting to know the outcome of something, it's like, it depends. It could go either way at this time. Something may depend on the action that you take. Mm. I also feel that maybe someone is coming off as irritating, especially if they just keep trying to get your attention. Or maybe it's the way they're doing it. But again, it does look like any type of fighting there's been or someone who's been reluctant to talk, um, I feel like lets their guards down. I also feel that you're going to be forced to change. Like you're given an opportunity to change on your own, but if you continue this way, then I feel like outside forces are stepping in and forcing a change because it's not all about you. Your decision has something to do with everything. Everything works together. Um, everybody plays a role in this universe. So, something you might be refusing to do eventually I feel like you get thrusted into it it's like okay we've given you a lot of chances to do this on your own now you have no choice so I don't know what you're being thrusted into but I feel like it may have something to do with your spiritual path I'm getting the name Simon for somebody. And also sevens could be significant or double sevens. Um, looks like somebody has been trying to avoid temptation um, especially if someone is an earth sign. Oh, yeah. I also feel like there is an earth sign that where the two of you are equally obsessed with each other. There may be unfinished business that you're trying to ignore. Something's being eclipsed, too. There's some sort of secret that is going to come into the light. Somebody has been going out of their way to avoid you or you have been going out of your way to avoid someone. So just like I was saying earlier, like it looks like you're walking with your head straight up and walking by someone or... Um, whoever you are intentionally trying to avoid, I feel like you're going to have to talk to them. Mm. Looks like you're trying to block someone or cut off communication or cut off some sort of connection, but it's still there. And in fact, I feel like the more you try to avoid it, the worse it gets or the more intense it becomes. And I kind of feel like somebody's jealous or is trying to get revenge. Hmm. 
I'm getting something about control. Um, either someone can't control themselves around you or you them. Maybe it's mutual. Yeah, I feel like there's a very strong attraction. Hmm. I feel like there's a need to confront the past. You're being encouraged to just confront the past. Yeah. Something is like a once in a lifetime opportunity or it's a rare opportunity and it's coming towards you. I feel like you're going to have clarity or the truth is coming out. Someone looks like they are gaining the courage to come forward with the truth. So whoever's been avoiding you or hiding something like they're going to have the courage to come forward. Someone also is regretting their past actions. Someone feels bad about the way they handle a situation in the past. It could be you or it could be the person you're dealing with. But this is a chance to correct it. This is an opportunity to make things right. And it doesn't just have to be romantic. It could be anything. Someone has been hiding their desires or their attraction, but you can feel it. Hmm. I feel like trust issues are also challenging. Something is, you're, you're going to have to work on your trust issues or someone is coming into your life that's going to help you work through that. Again, it doesn't have to be romantic. It might be a new friend. Maybe it's some people that you're meeting at work. But I, I feel like you're having to confront some sort of trust issues. All right, let's pull some energy cards. All right, additional messages for air, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, Sun, Moon, or Rising for this Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Door to value journey, cornucopia, overall energy, happy family. All right, so you guys are going to be feeling really lucky this weekend. Um, I also feel like now that's what the wheel was talking about. So you guys might hit the jackpot, um, whether it be financially or emotionally. Um, but I feel like you guys are enjoying like a lot of abundance maybe good eating um you might be doing things together as a family you also might have some sort of dream or premonition about uh your love life or about anything and it just seems like man that was an amazing preview i cannot wait for that to you know begin you also may be uh, enjoying just family time, watching movies. Money might be spent over the weekend. You might be buying gifts or treating yourself or treating family. Um, now, it also looks like 
someone could be on their way or I don't know if someone's visiting or if someone's getting ready to move in um, because it looks like someone is saying the door is open you guys are also maybe following your path um, some sort of financial or career path that you wanted I feel like the door is open for that now or there's that window of opportunity and it looks like you're going through it so I feel like you are going to have security and abundance this weekend I feel like you're also going to be glad that you took a chance or that you followed your intuition because I feel like you were resistant towards something at first but once you let your guards down I feel like the outcome is going to be pretty good for you you might be seeing 11's and and twos and fours this weekend yeah so look for those numbers for any type of confirmation something seems like a real gift or blessings from the universe are just falling upon you something might seem like a dream it's like this is unreal this can't be happening this is too good to be true but it looks like you have it all it, you know at least whatever it is that you ask for even if you feel like you don't ask for much I feel like you're going, you're going to receive more than what you asked for or more than anticipated um, something turns out to be just so much better even if you got your dream job and when you start you're like like holy shit this is even better than what I thought like I'm so glad that I, I took this job um, so yeah something's gonna turn out to be um, a big surprise and I just feel like you're gonna be feeling very blissful and appreciative you also might be in a position where you have so much abundance that you're able to share that could be money it could be um, space in your home it could be that you have extra cars then somebody needs one like you know you have something to share with other people mm. So yeah, and I'm also getting something about crossing a bridge. I don't know if you thought bridges have been burned, but I'm not getting that bridges are burned. I feel like uh, there's hope. Yeah. So, you know, basically that, that's all that I have for you guys, but you know, hopefully something resonates. Feel free to leave your comments. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Sending love and grace.